Hey YouTube, welcome to Wise World. Today I have my first, um, I'm guessing, Dollar High Club. And I just had to show you guys because I thought it was absolutely adorable that it says shipped with love from DC. <laughs> DHC Supply. I'm guessing that's Dollar High Club. Um, it's kind of creepy how Google can just <laughs> give you suggestions on what you want to look at while you're looking at other things because of your previous history. Now, I think it's creepy, but I also love the death out of it. Um, so I get this. I opened up my Instagram the other day, and it said Dollar High Club, and I'm like, ooh, I haven't heard of that one. Let me check it out. Oh, and I just totally stabbed the box with my knife. It's okay. See? It's Dollar High Club. It's all right. You know, like the Dollar Shave Club. I haven't tried that, but I've been wanting to. Um... It opens just like, oh, that's a really shitty stamp. There's some American woman, and I don't mean that in a negative way, stamping that on by hand. Um, I don't know if that's a cute thing or a bad thing. Um, I don't know. I think there's, it's supposed to look cool, but I think it just looks kind of shitty. Uh, that's my opinion. Uh, my opinion's my opinion. My opinion is why I'm doing this channel. Okay. Mm, let's open it up. God damn. Okay. Before I peek, Let's see, Halloween. Oh, that's so cool. You can't really see because of my new light. It says Hi Halloween, Halloween. Um, and then it has um a whole list of what's coming in here, which I do not want to read right now. I also know I ordered the most expensive box that you can order because I'm a glass girl and I love my glass. So um, I'm guessing glass. We say the best for last. Oh, okay. I had one of these in the past. Um, this is really fun. A lollipop. Um, this is, it's just fun because it's actually kind of gross. It gets really sticky. It's just, it's a pipe made out of sugar. Um, and if you are 20 something, you've probably seen these if not tried one. Um, I'm very nostalgic, and um, I remember having um, a blue and a purple one, and the blue one was good because I love blue raspberry. The grape was gross because I don't like grape-flavored shit, even though I love grapes and wine. But um, this one is watermelon. I've never had the watermelon. Watermelon is my favorite Jolly Rancher. So, oh, and Jelly Belly, of course, because, you know, the green on the inside and pink on the inside. But anyways, um, this is just a lolly, um plastic tube for, okay, so this did not have one it's a re it's, it will not melt from the flame i'm sorry yeah they're probably right it won't melt from your big flame but the mouthpiece gets really sticky from your saliva and it starts to melt um and eating it <clears throat> okay but um i remember back in the day did not come with the plastic tube let's see what the plastic tube one taupe tube cigar band for easy non-stick handling Oh, you're supposed to stick the tube in the pipe so your mouth doesn't get on it. That's pretty smart, okay? So they did, they fixed that flaw. They've had a decade and they fixed the flaw. But what the fuck's the point? I don't know. There's four different flavors. It's cute. It's awesome for, like, um, festivals and, you know, day trips. Cool, cool, cool. You can smell, throw it out. It's not going to um, hurt the environment. It's going to disintegrate. Cool, cool, cool. I haven't got one of these in one of my boxes, so it's kind of dope. And again, I'll probably give this to a gift for somebody. Um, yeah. Okay, what else do we have? Oh. I just got one of these. Oh, it has, it, has a glass, it has a glass slide in there. Um, I just got one of these bee tubes. I can't know. I don't know if you guys can see this. Um, it's actually sitting right here. Um, and yesterday's Halloween box. Um, and this has the same sticker on the inside, but it's blue and it has a glass slide in it. If you don't know what a glass slide is, it's a tiny little piece of glass that you put into a pipe that does not have a very, um, not small, because you don't want small. It doesn't have a decent sized hole. It might be too big. If it's too small, don't use this. But if it's too big, definitely use one of these. This is actually a really shitty one, but, um, I don't know if you can see that. Probably not. This light is killing. Hold on. Maybe we should just turn it off. Um, little tiny slide. Or you just put it in the bottom of your pipe and it helps get your scoobs from getting in your mouth. It keeps it in the bowl. 
that made any fucking sense to anybody. Um, anyway, so we got this B2 with a little glass slide in it. We have a very small Dollar High Club edition package of Zen pipe cleaners. Zen. Dollar High Club. They come in handy. Um, a lot of people like to save the res like I do, but there's a point where after you get all the good res out, you just really need to get it clean. So, And then there's also some very, very technical pieces of glass that you might own, like I do, that you're going to need one of those unless you want to spend three hours shaking some ISO in that bitch. Yeah, no, use one of those. Half hour ISO. Then that. You're going to win, I promise. Anyways. Ooh, okay. Okay, Juicy J's. This is a... Um, a Juicy J with two Juicy Cones and one reusable wooden tip. Um, and I'm now finding these wooden tips and a lot of things. And I still haven't tried one. But this is a watermelon Juicy J. It matches the watermelon flavor I already got. So kind of cool. Um, and I really enjoy these tubes when I am out of my wraps. <laughs> um, other than that, uh, it's not my cup of tea. I learned how to roll a long, long time ago. I'm motherfucking good at it. So, anyways. Oh! Okay, my favorite smelling tree cone thingy for your car or anywhere else. Black ice. It smells, it smells like money. It smells like quality. I don't know if you know what quality smells like or looks like or feels like, but I really do. Um, and to me, this just smells like quality. Thank you. Um, oh my god, I am so sick of this shit. But this is by a different brand. Um, B.U.S.O. Hempwick. Ooh, who the fuck cares? Dude, I know people love these hemp wicks, but they're, I think they're dumb, and honestly, I think you can start a fire a lot quicker with this than a bit. So, yeah, that's all some stoners need. Something that's just going to continuously burn. Anyways, the Three Castle Tobacco. No better brand than the Three Castle. 50 leaves. Oh, Superior Rolling Papers. Okay. Alright. Golden, Virginia, Boston, and London. And I can tell these papers, they have little lines on them. I don't think you can see this on camera, but they have little lines. And it helps it burn slower, which is nice. Um, this is a mix between a raw and a zigzag. Maybe closer to a raw. And it, yeah, definitely closer to a raw. Decent paper. Thank you for being a part of the doll. See, okay, you people, why would you do this? This is Happy Halloween. Thank you for being part of the Dollar High Club, right? Super cute, super adorable, but why are you going to give me one Sour Patch Kid? What? I love sour candy, fruity candy. You can give me one? That's mean. It, it, it. A clipper lighter with this dope ass skull on it, which the skull is dope, okay, but it's a motherfucking clipper lighter, and it has a bigger flame than a big half of the life of a big, um, I really hate them, I've burnt myself on these many times, I don't burn myself by X, or um, on purpose, you know what I mean, by stupidity of dumb lighters, imagine all of this metal getting hot, right? You're not even flicking it no more. It got hot from you doing whatever you were doing. And now you put it in your hand and you hit your arm with it. Someone else's arm with it. Your finger with it. Ah! Blister. Yeah. I like idiot proof things that are made so you don't hurt yourself. Um, if you decide not to think for a few minutes. What else did we get? Ooh, we got some raw classic tips. I use the shit out of tips, so... And I've actually, um, out of Elements, um, Raws and, uh, OCBs, I love, I love the Raws. Um, I like the way they soak up the resin, um, and I like the way they feel in your fingers. Um, they say that they're made with a little bit of cotton for texture and, um, bendability, and I really, really like that. Very cute. And then we got some stickers. I always know what I want for Halloween. Dot, dot, dot. Hi. <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> if this is what they put in the fucking Halloween box, I'm almost excited for the Christmas box. 
Christmas. Like, how are they going to put hi into Christmas? Uh, Santa Claus is happy to see me. Hi! H-I-G, get it? <laughs> Anyways, um, this is a very cute sticker. I will definitely be hanging that up on my oven with a magnet. Welcome to the Dollar High Club. The street delivery quality supplies more fun than bingo. Um, bingo can get mean, so this is a little more fun than bingo. Um, share your experience and win a mega box. Oh, what the fuck is a mega box? Why didn't I get a mega? I want a mega box. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. Yeah, no shit. Well, what do you think I'm doing? I'm sharing it right now. I want this three hundred plus dollar value box. Yes. Anyways, one more sticker. It is a fucking pumpkin man, jack o' lantern man, holding the fucking thing of joints and a bunch of smoke. It's pretty cool. I like that. That is the end of the box, except for what I saved for last. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? We need a knife. Oh, that rubber band's gonna snap in my face. No, thank you. Oh god, that's a really stretchy rubber band. Whoa, okay, maybe not. We don't need the knife for that then. Jesus. Could I put my eye out? Now I have my glasses on just to do this video. I mean, I put my eye out with that. <laughs> okay. <gasps> I don't know if it's supposed to be a spider. Or what? But this is cool. This is hand blown. These have like three little tentacle hands. And I'm like, is this supposed to be like an alien? Some sort of odd alien? I don't know, because these look like hands. From a certain cartoon movie I can't think of the name of right now. Where the chimps go to space. They look like the hands of the dudes on that planet. And then these look like fucking spider legs, but there's only three on each side, so I'm kind of confused. Um, and then it has a nice ass carb hole. And the bowl's right there. And the bowl hole's a little big, so I might actually use this little slide, um, glass slide that came in this tube for a minute, just till it rises up a little bit so I can use it better. But that hits really nice, and I kind of like that the bowl's in the middle. Doesn't really give it a steamroller effect. It gives it, it gives it its own effect, and I am super super stoked to try this. Um, this is the first out of all of my glass boxes, um, other than the one like vacuum sealed Sherlock that I got that was like made out of some machine somewhere. I did look it up, um, and it was blow my mind. But that was not no hand blown glass, and I can really tell that this was hand hand blown. And I really enjoyed this pipe. Um, and I hope I hope it hits as well as it looks. And I'm really excited to finally get something full color. Full color, and yeah, these might break off. If you're if you're an idiot, all of these glass things be very, very, very careful with. Um, because you can break those off very quickly. Um, but other than that, I mean the air hole, the carb hole, nice big pull hole, not too big, ain't gonna burn your finger. Um, yeah, this looks like a weird pineapple. <laughs> There, it's a pineapple. Is, is it a pineapple? Is that what this is supposed to be? Okay, please comment below if you think this might be a pineapple. All right, YouTube. Um, what did we get? We got um, a pineapple alien bowl. I'm really stoked about that. We got a, 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 a tube with a little tiny glass slide in, which will come in handy. We got some raw, regular size tips. Always ecstatic about those. We got the weird lollipop, new and improved, with this tube. Instead of putting your mouth on it, use a tube. Yeah, cool. We got one sticker. Two stickers. We have a chance to win the Mega Box. I don't win shit, so I don't even know why. But um, we have a little tree. Nice black. This is, I'm saving for my new Jeep. It's going to be the first thing put in there other than freaking speakers. Um, we have an ugly ass clipper skull lighter. Again, this will go in my junk drawer for emergency people who come over to my house and say, girl, I got to drive all the way home. I ain't got a lighter. Here, bitch. Take this. 
Um, we have a uh, Dollar High Club Zen little pack of pipe cleaners. We have some B Lazo Hemp Wick, which I'm guessing this is a better brand or a smaller company, which makes my heart feel good. But at the same time, I don't like the Hemp Wick. Don't like these lighters. That's my opinion. I pay for these boxes and they come with stuff I don't like. That's that's my fault. But I don't like either thing. I really don't. I don't have any friends who'd be like, oh yeah, I have plenty of friends who don't care what lighter they use, but this hemp shit? No. Going back in the box for good. Um, one little sour patch candy for Halloween. I can't really say much about that. Um, and then we got three Castles tobacco rolling papers. We got two Juicy J Watermelon Jones. Oh, they're called Jones, not Cones, because of the J. <laughs> Funny. Um... And I think for once, that is all. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up and subscribe. If you didn't like this video, hit the thumbs down. If you have something to say to me or about me, please put it in the comments below. And please, if you think you know what this was supposed to be, is it a pineapple? Is it an alien? If you knew what it was supposed if you know what this thing is supposed to be, please let me know in the comments. Or if you want to name it for me, that too. Um, anyways, I'll see you guys soon because I know I got at least two more hemp boxes, I don't, cannabis boxes coming, and I'm going to try to do them one after the other. This one arrived just today, and in the next 20 minutes, this video should be up online for y'all to enjoy. Anyways, thank you all to my little subscribers that I have, and if you'd like to check the next video out, please subscribe to my channel. See you guys next time. Bye!